Hello, everybody. Party here. Welcome to Whisper Secrets: Tying the Knot by Grandma Studios. Let's take a look at this new game. Here we go. It's a nice day to travel, detective. You solved the Flustel case perfectly. Thank goodness things are calmer here in the London suburbs. Another disappearance in woods outside the town of Flusto. Look out, detective! Someone's trying to break into the Count's estate. Pronounce you husband and hey you stop him. I need to help the bride. She is unconscious. It's you. You were the famous detective who solved the case in Flusta. I'm Count Victor Osmond. Someone in a raincoat attacked my bride during the wedding. I can't tell if she's breathing, but it may just be shallow. Please, find something to check if she is. Can we check her pulse? Check if the bride is breathing or not. Okay, let's check her pulse. Uh, my dear daughter, uh, congratulations on this wonderful day. It is a pity that your father is not with us. He would be very happy with Vector. I'm too weak to come, but I'm with you in spirit. Your loving mother, Veronica Bjornes. And a strange symbol on their notes. And now we need something to help me see if she's breathing or not. Can we find a mirror, guys? Maybe a little compact. Gross! I need to scare them away. They are holding important items, I'm sure. Doctor, please stop by before the wedding to examine Simon. There will be no guests at the ceremony, so no one will distract you. From Count Victor Osmond. P.S. Hopefully the crows won't take the letter out of the box again. I'll send a copy of the letter with the coachman. Simon? Who is Simon? The mirror. That's what we're gonna use. And we can unlock this by using the clue. So there's a missing pin. A missing piece. It looks like the culprit's cloak got caught in the door. Yeah, he went inside the building. So let's just rip that away. <laughs> okay, we do have a wrench. Got a lamp. And that's a little piece for the copy mirror, guys. Tweezers. Perfect. Door is locked, of course. It's a greenhouse door. Are we not going to do the puzzle? Ah, uh, here we go. The mirror mechanism. Arrange the mirror clamps to match the image on the instructions, and select a jewel to rotate the mirror clamps it's attached to. Okay, so... Do something like this. The white is in the middle, or not? Okay, I think that's good enough. Level 2. So this whole thing rotates. Pretty simple. And I can't see anything. Oh God, maybe she's just out of breath. Pulse, check her pulse. Okay, so nothing show up on the mirror, huh? Oh boy. Now we're swapping the pieces. We are done. Okay, there's a pulse. Yes. Her breathing is faint, but thank God she's alive. 
Everyone in the city knows about you. We're lucky you happen to be here. Thank you, Detective. Did you see where the criminal ran? Maybe he left fingerprints, or even some parts of his outfit. We did have a part. Yeah, we got a part of the outfit, though. No? Oh, the cloak. Oh no. That scoundrel ran to the greenhouse. Yes. My brother Simon is there now. He's completely helpless. You see, my brother isn't mentally well. You may need pills to calm him down. Here's a key. The pills should be in his doctor's bag. Simon is the brother. Okay, new task. Calm Simon down. Okay, we have to go, guys. Simon, are you in here? Where has the culprit gone? And where is Simon? Don't see him anywhere, guys. Where is he? Uh, the bees could sting me. Need something long to reach the hive. And there's a missing heart. Ladder up the tree. Very dark in this hollow. So we do have a lamb. We need some fuel. Fuel operator lamp. Bees. Bees are aggressive. Need to distract them with something. With that honeycomb, guys. So this is Doctor's bag. Uh, now, Vector, your crows are still attacking me on my way home. They even stole the key to my bag. Please do something about this. I'll leave the bag to you. So, the crows are his pets? <laughs> crows, not the bees, but the crows. Simon? You are Simon. They, they shouldn't marry. They're all be taken away. They're always taken away. Calm down, Simon. You don't believe me, do you? But my brother doesn't understand the consequences of getting married. I do. Well, it seems that the Kang's brother is haywire. His words are very suspicious. Maybe he's telling the truth? <laughs> well, he's clearly unstable. Okay, I need those pills, guys. Is there a puzzle at the back? With a uh, missing piece. We need three star frames to complete the puzzle. And a handprint. Oh, wait, uh, can we go back? <laughs> There's a matchbox. Hold on, guys. There's a matchbox over here. Grab that one. Oh, hello, little squirrel. Whoa, he stole the bullets. Where did he go? Up the tree? Oh, I see you in the dark. <laughs> you cannot hide from me, little squirrel. I see you well. I think he's e eating a nut. Yeah! <laughs> what a cute little fee if you're feasting on a nut. But the chest was securely hidden. Perhaps a criminal hid it. Thank you for letting me take in... Thank you for letting me take all those items. <laughs> we didn't even have to trade with the squirrel guys. So we do have butterfly nets. Catch your butterflies. Oh, actually, no. <laughs> Just grab the honeycomb. Get the bees. Now, a specific shape to open this. Uh, the cross shape. We got a rival. Okay, what are we shooting, guys? Uh, okay, maybe just scare the crows away. It worked. 
chess ring. Right, time for another puzzle. Rotate parts of the image to restore it, and select and drag a ring to rotate it. Middle part is in place. It's a castle. It's a burning castle. It's on fire. The assignment, this key to the secret passage is for you, son. Let it be the magic key to your adventures. Your mother and I love you, our dreamer. Your loving father, B. Osmond. Shovel. And a dagger. The pruners. This is very interactive. They find places to use all these items. Or some of these items. The rose is barely holding on. Perhaps I can pick it out with something sharp. Knife. Bright coins can attract a crow to the nest. The turtle with the missing shell. Right there, there is a boat. Gem ice, ruby ice. Crow in nest. How do we lure in the crow? Just by gathering all the coins. Put them all into the nest. A plus symbol. A turtle shell. Oh, right there! It's half berry, guys. There we go. Ah, got all the coins? Nice. Where is the symbol? The plus sign. Is it here? Oh, right there. <laughs> it's a medical symbol. <laughs> For the doctor's bag. So we also have two halves of the heart. The doctor snoked on Simon's illness. Your brother is having hallucinations. He sees a cloaked figure. Perhaps this is due to the trauma he experienced. In any case, I'm ready to help him at any time. But he wasn't lying, guys. He really did see the cloaked figure, just like how we saw the cloaked figure just now. He really does exist. So the pills. All right, Simon, be a good boy and take these pills. They're good for you. No, you'll all burn. I'll just wait. Whoa! Calm down, Simon. Where are you going? You'll pay like you always do. You can't get married. Calm down, Simon. Don't lose your head. I have to take Adele to the house.
I need to find another way in. Assignment locked the door. The count is probably too distracted to remember I'm here. I need to find a way out. I think something fell out of Simon's pocket. What is it? Oh, that thing. Part of the puzzle, guys. So I believe those are all the parts. Can we put this all together now? Use a frame to connect pairs of tokens according to the clues on the right, and place the three frames onto the tokens on the board. Then move half of each frame onto the adjacent tile, or through one tile to connect the correct pairs. Clue parts turn gray when a correct combination is made. That sounds complicated. <laughs> so we have three frames, and we then we have three combination of colors here, guys. So I guess we're doing this one line at a time. Green, orange. Okay. Uh, yellow and blue. Green and yellow. Green and yellow. Can I rotate the tile? Green, yellow. Oh! Oh! Wait, hold on guys. What is happening? I can actually separate the two. <laughs> what the heck? Okay, orange and yellow. See, I can separate them. <laughs> Green and purple. Green and blue. Green and blue. Diagonal? Can it be diagonal? It cannot. Green and blue. But they can be... Like this. Okay. Space in between work too. Now green and red. Vertical link. Orange and pink. Can we diagonal? <laughs> it cannot. Again, it cannot be diagonal. So let's do the vertical one. Alright, can we... Come on. There we go. Now green and yellow. Next one. Red and pink. Orange and purple. Orange and purple. Can the links cross each other, guys? Yes. Purple and red. Are we done? Whose bedroom is this? Simon? Simon's room? The house is on fire! What? Uh, search for clues and the criminal. I found a way to put out the fire. Escape the room and help Vector. Okay, it's on fire. How did it happen, guys? Uh, the piece of fabric is stuck. We don't have time to worry about this, guys. <laughs> so... can see outside the window. That fiery glow. The smoke coming in through the doorway. The door is tightly closed and it looks like there's a fire. Yes. It sounds like a fire and it smells like a fire. <laughs> and Simon, please stick your pills on time and don't break your mother's sewing machine. I'm tired of fixing it. I understand that sewing helps you, but next time I'll have to take it. Your brother, Vector. Okay, lockbox. There is an item at the top. Box topper. Oil bottle. We got pieces of fabric. So I see words on the wall. Simon wrote all these guys. Burn! We will burn! Wow. We will burn. We will burn! 
So was he the one who set the fire, guys? That looks rusty. Clear the rust. My cloak will help. It will help her not be afraid. I oh, will put it on and I can talk to her again. So this note is written by Simon. So who is this person here? Is he talking about his brother's wife? The bride? It looks like Simon's chest. Maybe I'll find some answers inside. Okay, we got Simon's chest. <laughs> it's like a brain. So four missing items. Is that a brooch? No. It's like four shapes. Simon doesn't seem very happy to be with Vector in his portraits. He scratches his face. 